What's up everybody, Mr. Martin here to walk you through making two parts in this video uh, for our train project. We're gonna make a hitch magnet and hitch pin, uh, two of the easiest parts that we can make for this project. The first thing we're gonna do is the hitch magnet. Uh, to do that, we are going to make a new sketch and we're gonna switch things up this time and use the top plane um, just to be different. So we're gonna make two circles uh, centered at our origin. The first circle is gonna have a diameter of 0.25 inches. The second circle is gonna have a diameter of 0.45 inches. And that's it, we're gonna finish the sketch, zoom out, and we're gonna extrude the area inside the circle, like the middle of the cylinder, not the actual middle of the cylinder. You know what I mean, the donut part. And we're going to extrude that, extrude that a distance of 0.25 inches. And that's the part. I mean, can't get any easier than that, right? Two circles extruded a quarter of an inch. Uh, we'll go ahead and do our normal thing where we change the material type to PLA so we can get our data correct and know all about our volume and density and mass and all that stuff. Um, and then we'll bring up our mass property. You should have a volume of about 0 0.027 inches. It's, it's, it's a small part. Um, and that's one thousandth of a pound. So let's go ahead and move on to our hitch pin. A little bit more complicated than the hitch magnet. Um, we are going to do what we have done for the last few parts and we're going to draw a sketch on our front face, face and then revolve it. Um, this is just the easiest way to do it in on shape, to be honest. I'm going to draw a vertical line that is 0.65 inches. I'm going to cancel out of that. I'm going to draw a horizontal line that is 0.125 inches. I'm going to draw another vertical line. That's not vertical. I'm going to draw another vertical line that is 0.5 inches and then a horizontal line that is 0 0.075 inches, and then I'm going to hit cancel. Move some stuff out of the way, you can see a little bit better. Then we are going to make a three point arc. So our default arc is a three point arc. So we're going to click the end points of that line. And we want this to be about a radius of 0 0.28. Um, we want it to look kind of like this. Nope, I clicked the wrong thing, didn't I? All right, try that again. Uh, when you're making your three-point arc, make sure you're clicking the top and the outside of this, the, the, the farthest right point. Okay, so click here, and we're going to type in a radius of 0 0.208. And you can see that a little bit better there. And we have our shape, and that's it. And we're going to finish our sketch. And zoom out, zoom in. And we're going to revolve and we're going to revolve this face and we're going to revolve it around that axis and it's going to make a pin and that's the shape. That's it. Nothing, nothing too special about that. Again, assign your material, make it a PLA. That's what we print in, in my classroom. So we actually have a real idea of what it would look like. And there's the mass properties of that. Uh, so it's about double the, the double the mass of the magnet um, and volume of 0 0.036 cubic inches. So yeah, that's it for the hitch magnet and hitch pin. Hope you're all doing well. And if you have any questions, let me know. And I'll talk to you soon. Take it easy.